Boys and girls, it's the one and only Adam Cole Bebe, and you're watching Wrestling Revolution with Kate. So welcome in, Keaton. Not over. It's good to be here. Yep. We're so glad to have you in here. Initially, you said that you were, you know, that we uh, here at the NWF, we inspire you. Explain yeah, that. You, yeah, you did. Uh, start, uh, so after my first, uh, when I started getting into wrestling, uh, my back, um, ambition was always to be a professional wrestler from the very first time I saw it when I started seeing the next of John Cena. But then I thought, as me being a kid, uh, until I was a model, I couldn't do it. But until when I saw the NWF and stuff, I thought, Maybe I could be a kid wrestler, and then uh, Nathan had on that there's going to be kids wrestling on the same journey. It's cool. So you 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 know that it, I'm glad that you came across their stuff though to give you the spark and to give you the yeah. idea to do it. You know, you, you guys are so lucky today. Like you got you know you and Arnie over there in the UK because you have academies that you mm -hmm. can go to and train and yeah. learn it. Build up. Uh, he says, I can see they start things slow and build up. This is a big difference when you are carrying adults backing you. Yeah. You know, having that adult, like I said, the adult guidance is the, is the key here, guys. You know, having people that know the business showing the kids. That's the way to do it today. It just, it's just the way right. to go. Okay, reverse snapmare goes into a reverse chin lock. Very good. Very good stuff here. This is a good fundamental stuff to oh, be yeah. learning. Well, very old school over here that we're seeing right now. Exactly. What I like to see is teaching the old school stuff, not. Well, yeah, because some of the some of the old school stuff the... Dave carries on, right? Oh yeah. Definitely. Exactly. What is your What's your goal then? Like, where Where do you want to? Where do you see yourself in all of this as you start yes. your training? I don't really want to go to American wrestling. I don't really want to get in WWE. I want to continue with NIPW, Nathan's promotion, and make it bigger instead of me going to a bigger company and make NIPW bigger. Maybe make it one of the biggest wrestling companies in the world. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. So, and your coach would know this. He knows what I'm saying. If you have the right head on your shoulders and you're in it to win it, and you're, you're just, I mean, I don't mean, when I say in it to win it, I don't mean win every match. I yeah. mean, win it as in being the best you can be in the business yeah. and that doesn't mean win loss record that means selling right yeah. I'll, I'll, ultimately you know here's the thing <clears throat> and i learned this from steve angstrom when he came into our show i learned from him and he's that adult that came in that really shouldn't have been but I what i but i, I learned from him though was pretty that boy yeah pretty boy taylor but what i learned from him and mr x is you sell your butt off in the match you sell and it makes the match. And that's what I picked up from him. And then when, the, when when we were both selling for each other, it becomes memorable matches. So, Keaton, this is a very interesting comment from Sky Sports Video News. And this is what I was telling you the other day on our private conversation. Uh, most young athletes that wrestle don't have half the knowledge that you are showing in this interview. You would make a great announcer as well, is what he's saying. And I told you that. And, that's uh, right. You know, listen, Listen to your match commentating on the matches on your channel. I, I I picked up on that immediately. You'd be one of, like, if you were in the NWF, Keaton, you'd be one of the guys that would say, you know, you can still wrestle, but I need you on the mic. You don't mind doing some play-by-play -play here when you're not having the matches? And, yep. Because yeah. that's what we do. We'd pick yeah. out guys that could do that. So what advice would you, you've given some really good advice, but what, what would be the biggest piece of advice you would give a young 12-year-old wrestler when they start out in the business? You know, like like I told Arnie, if somebody asks, "What's your goal in wrestling?" Well, my goal is to be world champion, and and I want to be the best I can be. And like I said, I don't mean win loss record. I mean best you can be. Just and enjoy it. If you're not enjoying this, it's not worth it. You have yeah, to really exactly. truly enjoy it, exactly. right? But that comes back to where we say though, you got to find your style. You know, when you do find your style, because because keep maybe your style might not be doing a moonsault. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You got to find what your style is in this, and then when you do, you'll know. You'll know when you have it, and then you go after it, and you be the best you can be at that style of, of a wrestler. Yeah, yeah. The best. That, that's know, the advice, really. 